Hi and welcome to an Android to Educate review. Today I'm going to give a quick demo on what I consider is the best free office app available. It's called Kingsoft Office. So what puts this one above the others is that you can edit and save documents, spreadsheets and presentations for absolutely zero cost. So first have a quick look at the adding existing document. You can see here that the layout is very crisp. The text is easy to read. The pictures are clear. The ribbon at the top of the screen is very well laid out. It's fairly easy to understand. You can share your document via mail, message or Evernote. You can even save as a PDF format. I'll demonstrate here if you click on save as. Change from doc to PDF. So next look is adding a spreadsheet. So if we go back to the splash screen and then click on the plus sign at the top there. Go to create, new document and open up blank spreadsheet. So you can see by this view it gives you a fairly standard spreadsheet look with the very similar looking ribbon at the top of the screen. There's lots of spreadsheet formatting features are included even a few different options of sorting data uh, all the standard charting tools are, are supported you can use formulas and some complex cell formatting. So lastly is a quick look at the blank presentation. Uh, at the X at the top you can click next to that and drop down another ribbon view. Once again you can share. There's only a Weibo option to share on this one. But it gives you a fairly standard sort of presentation list of options. Now I'm not saying that this is the best Office application. What I am saying is that this is by far the best free one that is available. If you just need basic office editing, you really don't need to pay for an app as this should do it all for you. Cloud storage is even an option here. If you go back to the splash screen, you can select on Send Cloud. You have the option of Google Drive, Dropbox, Box.net and add WebDAV or FTP. If you can't figure something out, there is a large help list available, so it's online. Lots of content with recent questions, frequently asked questions and quite a large product support community. So I hope that this gives you some idea of what the app looks like and if you want a list of all the features just click on the link below for further information from the developers.